well, that was a disaster. Um, we should have had that game buried. Uh, we really should have. Could have scored five quite easily, but we didn't. Uh, credit to Sevilla. Credit to their goalkeeper, uh, Bono. He made some wonderful saves. But yeah, yet again, we were, we were our own worst enemy. We just couldn't finish, uh, particularly in the first 15 minutes of the second half. We had, I don't know how many chances. It was just non-stop chance after chance after chance after chance. Uh, well defended from uh, Fernando, uh, Diego Carlos and the rest of the Sevilla defence. And uh, as I say, Bono made some uh, terrific saves. But it's just one of those days. It's one of those days and it's disappointing because it's a real chance to give Oli some silverware that he deserves. Uh, you know, there was a few heads raised. Uh, uh, Fred starting at the start of the game as well as De Gea. Fred, I thought, was brilliant in this game. Uh, you know, he dictated player uh, alongside Pogba. Fernandez played a little bit further forward, created a lot of chances as well. The midfield was solid. Uh, we just had two sloppy errors in us, and unfortunately, it resulted in in two severe goals. Um, oh, oh, football, it's so cruel at times. But yeah, uh, we did get another penalty. Um, that's 22 for the season. Uh, we could have had another one as well, but that wasn't given later in the game. But yeah, again, most of our penalties this season have been stone bowlers. And at the end of the day, just the opposition stopped following us in the box. Like, at the end of the day, if it's a penalty, it's a penalty. Doesn't matter how many you've had in a season. Uh, two or three have been dubious, I'll grant, but 20 haven't. Uh, but anyhow, we slotted it away uh, six minutes in, Fernandez, uh, or seven minutes, or whatever, early in. Uh, and then, unfortunately, Sevilla managed to get the equaliser. A little bit of sloppiness in the defence again. Uh, oh, I, I'm trying to think. Uh, they crossed it in, didn't they, for this one? Yeah, from the other side, I think uh, Juan Bissaka lost his man. Uh, and then it was crossed in. And it was a lovely finish from Suso uh, to make it 1-1. But I, I wasn't really worried at that stage. And then we came out all guns blazing in the second half. You know, again, this is the period we should have scored 3-4. You know, we should have put the game to bed. In the first half as well, we had chances where, you know, it was three on two or three on three counter-attacks and we just played the, the incorrect ball or uh, the shot wasn't very good at the end of it. Uh, Fernandez had a really, really good chance uh, that was well saved, I think, yeah, by Bono. Martial had a couple of chances. Rashford had a chance. Uh, Rashford looks... Looks like he needs a bit of a break, to be honest. Uh, you know, obviously the fans will get on him because he's been poor recently. And he has, I'll grant you. But, you know, when he starts firing again, I hope the same fans can swallow their pride. Uh, you know, because he is a phenomenal footballer and he's only going to get better. But yeah, he's came back from a lengthy injury and he hasn't been at the races. He really hasn't. Uh, he was one of the poor, poorest players on the on the pitch today, unfortunately. Uh, but yeah, he'll come back stronger. Um you know, a lot of our players have had that sort of uh, thing before, like Martial suffered in spells and he's came back uh, all guns blazing. So, yeah, I I'm not worried about Rashford. I just hope he doesn't get too much abuse from the fans. That's one thing I really hate. We've got very, well, to be honest, as modern football, uh, you know, modern day football uh, fans, very reactionary. Uh, you know, it obviously we all hurt and we all don't want to see our team lose, but it's pointless hurling abuse at players, particularly players who've scored 20 plus goals this season uh you know players who've actually done well like it, it just it, it's unnecessary and then the stupid comparisons we're comparing our own players against each other so if we did sign sancho it'd be sancho against greenwood it'd be martial against uh, uh rashford fernandez against pogba they play in the same fucking team they don't have to compete against each other oh this player's better this player's better doesn't matter as long as we perform at the end of the day and I know we didn't today but yeah it's just it's stupid like it, it's stupid compare them to the other team's players that's the whole point but anyhow um, yeah another bit of sloppiness in the defence Lindelof lost his man uh, Wan Bissaka didn't track uh, Luke De Jong's run and it's another cross and it's a simple tap in and yeah I mean that was 77 minutes something like that <sighs> and we just couldn't couldn't find the equaliser unfortunately so yeah we're out uh, which is very disappointing because the final will likely now be Sevilla and Inter Milan and that would have been fantastic us to play Inter Milan in the final uh, considering Sanchez has completed his move Lukaku obviously his plays there Ashley Young does so yeah it would have been great to you know see but unfortunately we've got Sevilla and either Inter or Shakhtar so. Don't know if I'll be watching that one, but hey-ho. <laughs> um, 
yeah, at the end of the day, the season's over. We've been to three semi-finals. We've been knocked out in the semi-final stage of all competitions. So we need to do better next season. Finished third, thankfully, though. So we've got Champions League football. And yeah, we just need to focus. Uh, it looks as though we're going to start the, the season with the leaked fixtures uh, at home to Arsenal. So that would be good, you know, get a good win at the, Emir at, at the Emirates, at Old Trafford against Arsenal and start the season well. But yeah, now we, we focus on transfers because we do have a very good first 11. The backup options aren't amazing. So we do need to strengthen, you know, at least three players coming in would be fantastic. But hey-ho, that's for another time. Uh, yeah, it's just disappointment really. But, you know, that's football sometimes and we've just got to move on.